Hello, everyone. Let me ask you a question. How well do you love God? Have you ever considered this at all? Well, let me present to you some questions you could ask yourself. Are you ready? Do I ignore God or exclude him from my life? Do I neglect my daily prayers or say them badly? Is my prayer a real conversation with God in mind and heart? Have I used God's name in anger or carelessly? Have I missed Mass on a Sunday or Holy Day of Obligation through my own fault? Have I used bad language and told obscene jokes? Have I missed Mass on a regular basis? Have I been to confession before I resume receiving Holy Communion? Have I made an unworthy confession by omitting to confess all my mortal sins? Have I received Holy Communion in a state of mortal sin? Do I observe the one hour fast before receiving Holy Communion? Do I abstain from meat or perform some other act of penance on Fridays? Have I dissented from any of the teachings of the Catholic Church? Now let's consider the question on how well we love others. Have I neglected to teach my children their prayers or give them a Christian education? Have I taken part in or encouraged an abortion or any other means of taking human life? Have I been drunk, used drugs or given a bad example to others? Have I driven carelessly so as to endanger my life or that of other people? Have I been hypocritical? Have I placed myself in danger of sin by reading or looking at what was indecent or pornographic? Have I sinned against the virtue of purity by myself, masturbation or with others, fornication, adultery or homosexual acts? Have I abused anyone, either physically, mentally, emotionally or sexually? Have I dwelt on impure thoughts or desires? Have I been dishonest by stealing or cheating? Have I pampered myself on material comforts with little thought for the poor of the world? Have I been lazy at my work or at home? Have I, did an, have I taken an honest day's pay for an honest day's work? Have I been uncharitable or unkind in thought, word or deed? Have I gossiped about others, detracting from their good name? Has the sin of jealousy settled in my soul? Have I told lies? Have I judged others rashly? Have I harboured resentment or held grudges against others? Have I forgiven from my heart people who have hurt me inside or outside my family? Now, spouses can ask these questions. Do I pray for my husband or wife? Am I critical of my spouse, putting them down in public or in private? Do I make an effort to foster and show my love and affection for my spouse? Do I try to make up whenever there has been a disagreement or do I allow a resentment to continue Scripture says, don't let the sun go down on your anger. Am I too proud to say sorry? Do I mistreat my spouse verbally, emotionally or physically? Have I used artificial means of birth control in order to prevent having children? Have I committed adultery? Have I married outside the Catholic Church? Have I cohabitated with anyone before marriage and never confessed it? Have I received Holy Communion when cohabiting or received it while remaining married outside the church? 
Have I used IVF? That's in vitro fertilization. If you're a parent, then consider these questions. Have I been impatient, angry or jealous? Have I set my children a bad example by not bringing them to Mass or being careless about my religious duties? Do I take care to ensure that my children do not witness arguments at home? Do I look after my parents when they are old? Do I watch over the books that my children read and the television and videos they watch and what they get in, up to on social media? Do I take care to prevent to befriend my children? Am I over strict or over lax with them? Do I explain decisions to them and so help them grow to maturity? Do I set boundaries for my children or do I let them do as they please? Young people face many challenges today, so for you I suggest these questions to consider. Have I been disobedient or rude to my parents or teachers? Do I treat my parents with affection or respect or do I pray for them? If I live away from home, do I keep in touch with my parents and other members of my family? Do I quarrel frequently with my brothers and sisters or other members of my family? Do I study hard at home or college? Am I grateful for the sacrifices my parents have made for me? Do I show them my gratitude? Am I careful to set my friends a good example, especially in matters of behaviour, attendance at Holy Mass and moral issues? Do I realise that my example might help them take seriously their Christian calling? So then, how did you do? If this was the heavenly exam exa entrance exam, do you think you passed? Thank you for listening and God bless you all. Uh -huh.